It's a small defect that I found in um, Microsoft Word 2011 for Mac. So if you just open a document, and let's say 150%, and I say line one, line two, line three, let's separate them a bit, and highlight line one with any color you want, highlight line two with um, pink, and line three with, um, let's say, yellow. And let's make line one white text and leave the rest. So you can see it's green, pink, yellow um, highlights, and white, black, black uh, text. I'll just save this. Let's save it in um, my desktop here. I'll just call it dummy. And I'll save it. I'll close this. So green, pink, yellow. Remember that. I'll close it. I'll open it. The color is gone. It's all messed up. It doesn't matter what you do in this line. It just cannot understand that for some reason. So it messes up the colors. I mean, it's such a simple thing. So let's say I'll select another color. Let's just say red. I don't know if this is going to work or not. I'll save this document. I'll close it. So red, pink, yellow. I'll open it again. It worked with red. Let's say another color. I tested with some other colors and still wouldn't work. Let's say gray. So gray, purple, yellow. Sorry, uh, gray, um, pink, and yellow. It's gone. It's actually white now. You see, it, the background color is, is completely different. And here it doesn't understand what color it is. It still says it's gray, whereas it's actually not gray. Don't know what other color we can test. Dark blue. I mean, that's not bad. Okay, dark blue. Close it. <laughs> this is not dark blue. Maybe in Microsoft Word this is dark blue. I don't know, but this is this is a huge huge problem because I'm, I want to color code some stuff and I think I'm just going to shift to um, iWork and start using pages instead of Microsoft Word. I spent a lot of money in this and not very happy to be honest. So anyway, just want to highlight this issue.